Alright, hey everybody, 3D Icicle Freeze here. In the last part, we started at, uh, you know, we basically started with the Yellow Turban Rebellion, and we basically put them down, but in the end, we could see that the people were happy, and they liked our, our way. Anyway, in this part, we are going to Hulao Gate in hopes to defeat Dong Jua. Um, for this battle, I am going to actually choose Zhang Fei. Um... If you choose Guan Yu, which is what I'd normally do, but I'm not going to in this case. Um, there are some, like, there's actually a cutscene, so obviously I'm going to have to come back here at some point, which isn't a big deal. But, um, the, there's a reason for my madness. <laughs> Basically, it's just because uh, next battle, I'm going to play Guan Yu. And, um... Next battle, I wouldn't recommend choosing Zhang Fei. Let's just say that. But anyway, uh, let's begin. Alright. Uh, I at least want to equip... Yeah, we have some great weapons already, so... No point in keeping my two crappy weapons. Serpent Blade, yeah. Those are absolutely good. Anyway, we got Cao Cao and Leo Bay here. I see, you are here because you want to save the people. Correct. I can trace my ancestry through Prince Jing of Zhongshan. I cannot let this threat to the Han stand. I see. So tell me, Leo Bei, what future do you see for the Han? What exactly do you mean? Brother, let's get going. Yes, okay. Master Cao Cao, I hope to see you later. Now we strike, defeat the monster Dong Zhuo, and bring happiness back to the people. Alright, so Dong, uh, Dong Zhuo. Um, so Zhang Fei is a pretty awesome guy. At, oh, excuse me. As you can see from the way he, um, he speaks, he's probably going to be pretty strong. And sure enough, he is. Um, I really like Zhang Fei a lot, however, I always liked Guan Yu a little bit more. However, judging by... Um, past stats, uh, Zhang Fei is usually more offensive and Guan Yu is more, usually more defensive. Of course, them both being really powerful, you know, anyway. Um, but you're going to see that Zhang Fei is really, really powerful. So, um, I think you guys will enjoy playing him. Again, um, if you chose Guan Yu for this battle, um, it wouldn't be... So, <laughs> as you can see, that's his other X attack. Uh, he freaking Zhang Fei drinks, and then he gets an attack buff. Which is actually really cool. And as you can see, I do crazy amounts of damage on this guy. But um, but anyway, as I was saying, yeah, if you chose Guan Yu for this battle, um, you would be getting some... You would be getting a cutscene, I believe. Um, and then you'd be getting more like dialogue between characters as well. Um, I am probably going to be doing this on my own time. But, um, you know, obviously, like, I'll, I can hold off on that. Anyway, it seems that the, the front line needs our help, so why don't we go help, and when we get to the front line, we will see... Soon Jian is here. Yep. Soon Jian on the front line. Anyway, um, unfortunately, the one flaw I really don't like about Zhang Fei is that his Muso attacks are, like... I believe, I believe, uh, I'm not sure about all three of them, but I know that, obviously, as you can see, that first one requires you to grab onto someone. I really don't like lock on Muso attacks, but unfortunately, you know, he has one. Because Leo, uh, because Zhang Fei has amazing attack power, as well as really good, like, you know, like, you know, his speed's not too bad, but um, he has good crowd clearing. You know, he has a good combination of things, and so I really hate his, uh, I hate his lock-on. No, I mean, not that I hate it. It's not bad. And, of course, he does swing the person he grabs around, which does hit a few other people, but... But, um, but no, Zhang Fei is a cool character other than that. I just don't, I just don't prefer his lock-on. Oh... Uh, Okay, sorry. Wait. Hit two! Okay, sorry about that. Ugh. So, what have you guys been up to? Um, I haven't really been doing much. 
Um, as you could obviously tell, I'm not, I'm not feeling 100%, but again, I really want to record, and I really don't care, <laughs> you know. Um, I mean, obviously, I... Oh, okay, my... Apparently, my... Hold on one second. Okay, and I'm sorry about that cut there. Um, oh boy, do I hate wires. <laughs> anyway, um, unfortunately we can't see that dialogue. We can see it. Actually, if we go to battle info, we can go to battle log. Nope, can't see it. That's stupid. Um, my freaking, basically if you want to know what happened, my, my wire came out of my laptop that you know, basically records it, and I just lost just a little bit of footage, it's just really annoying, but anyway, as I was saying, how are you guys doing? I haven't really been doing much, um, again, yeah, I haven't been feeling well, um, but I really do want to record, which I mean, in, you know, it does show my dedication and whatnot, and that's really not even what it's about. I really just want to record because I don't know when I'm going to get another chance to. If I, you know, if, you know, my sinuses continue to get worse, that's not going to help. So, you know, it's unfortunate, but, you know, what am I going to do? And I mean, again, um, Christmas is coming. Christmas Eve, I'm going to be busy. Uh, my birthday is the 28th, so obviously I'm not, you know, I'm going to be busy then. And then, uh, there's New Year's, so I mean, there's, there's a handful of things happening. Alright, so let's, and, but anyway, you know, enough about that. Let's just get on with it. And wow, that does a lot more damage than I thought it would. I thought it did. That did a heck of a lot of damage. Ah... Rubs. All right, when you come in here, you have Zhong Liao. All right, come on, Zhong Liao, let's do this. Let's dance. All right, well, that was easy. As you can see, Zhong Liao um, is here fighting for um, Dong Zhuo, but we've seen him on in Paul Fei fighting for Sao Sao, so you wonder how that how that takes place. Anyway, um, I'm just going to defeat these Ballista because I want to make it easier for the people who are attacking you. I, that's, usually I do that just to make it easier on the people who are marching there. Um, and then I just quickly go to the front line. Alright, so we almost got our rage attack coming up, which is nice. Ah! We got Wong Yu here. So let's defeat you. Wong Yu. Shall I, I, I don't even know what I was... I don't even know where I was going with that. Anyway, um... It's, it says Leo Bay is struggling. Assist at once. Um, it pretty much will say that even if it's... Even if he's at full health. Um... So, I mean, try not to, like, worry too much about that. But anyway, clearly Leo Bay needs our help, so... Let's, um... Let us go see how Leo Bay is doing. Anyway, I know he says to focus on the enemies right in front of us, but you're going to want to come here anyway. Um, and again, there's pretty much no enemies there, so... <laughs> doesn't really matter. Okay, we defeated you. Uh, I need these gates to open. Okay, and then there's Gao Shan right here. Let us defeat him. And then all shall be well. Um, once you defeat him, you should successfully secure the, um, the catapult. 
First, we have to wait for the dialogue, unfortunately. You're not even worth soiling my blade. Uh, but anyway, it says Leo Bay. Uh, Leo Bay has appeared now. It says Lobu has appeared in front. I guess we'll go just trigger that real quick. Brother. <laughs> Pathetic. He's pretty good. I am here to help. My lord, we cannot allow your light to be extinguished here. That's right. We must combine our strength and defeat this raging monster. <laughs> Entertain me if you can. Anyway, um, you're actually going to want to avoid him. You're going to want to continue through Hulao Gate. Uh, instead of... Hold on one second. Uh, let's defeat this gatekeeper and defeat Jiashu, who also works for Cao Cao after this, if you guys remember. So that is also another interesting thing. But anyway, yeah, uh, on normal, I'm sure Leo Bay could... Uh, uh, I keep saying Leo Bay. I meant to say, I'm sure Lu Bu could probably, like, three or four shot me. And I don't want to... Okay, that just his jump attack did a lot. Um... But anyway, come on, can this gate open, Sao Sao? Can you please shut up? Oh, okay. I'm not even gonna risk. Uh, dying. As you can see, yes, he does a lot. Even with a rage attack, though, that really won't do that much. Alright, come on. This is actually really annoying. Thank you for finally opening. Okay, I'm just gonna use my rage attack here, because I'd like to defeat him or not. Accidentally get hurt. Tagging Lulu. But anyway, you're gonna see my rage attack does do damage to Lubu, but it really doesn't do that much. So anyway, I'd rather just continue on. And they even tell you um, to disregard um, Lubu and just continue on. So anyway, we got Diao Chan here. Now, if you defeat Diao Chan right here, you do get him a little angry, and it's, uh, or actually, you don't even have to defeat him, you just attack her, excuse me, and then, um, oh, yeah, no, there it is. Anyway, um, so now he's coming at you, and now he is, he, he's even more powerful, so, um, and again, though, it is possible to defeat him, it's obviously just extremely difficult. And I don't, you know, I don't really want to face him right now. Alright, so anyway, let's defeat Jiang Ji and get this gate open. And what do you know, Dong Zhuo, leave it to Dong Zhuo to light his own city on fire. Oh, I missed the XP. Hello. Anyway, uh, there is going to be some frame rate, absolutely, with all the fire. Uh, it doesn't look too bad, though. I don't, I don't think it's too bad. Anyway, you're gonna see that there's peasants here. Basically, all the peasants are next to the, um, the mobile units. So if you defeat the mobile units, the fires get extinguished. Um, which, obviously, will give you hypothetical, you know, success in its own thing. Um, you know, so... It's like your own little version of hypothetical success. I don't. Oh, I almost thought that said Gan Susan defeated Lu Bu. I was like, wait, what? Anyway, no. What I was trying to say was, um, I don't think there's actually any, like, quote unquote, like official hypothetical successes. I could be absolutely wrong. And I'm sure I am. But, um, there we go. Dong Joe's defeated.